special responsibility. I find them very comforting and very relatable in my everyday life. There are so <laughs> many similarities between a well-built zombie and the rat race that we are stuck in every day. If you do not, if you are not completely satisfied with your job, you will understand when I say that a mundane nine-to-five job can easily suck the life and ambition out of you and turn even the best of men into just empty headed airheads like some. Tonight, uh, I often like to draw conclusions and also like to draw different workplace survival skills from watching different zombie movies. And tonight, I would like to share some of my reflections with you. First, at the start of any zombie apocalypse, and also at, at the time of any crisis, you will feel alone. <laughs> you are likely going to be alone. Every single zombie movie that I've seen started the same way. The protagonist is, is like, when all hell breaks loose, the protagonists feel lost and alone and out of control as they discover that the world that they once treasure is overfilled with, with zombies trying to eat them alive and turn them into one of those empty-headed people. Don't be afraid. Even if it seems like the world is coming to an end, you are never alone. There are always survivors like you out there. Go find them, fight with them. You need them and they need you too. And no one should ever fight zombies alone. Except of course, if you are Michonne from the Walking Dead and that you have a samurai sword and a zombie camouflage. Second, be selective about who you align yourself with. And once you choose your right group, uh, be a contributor to that group. Just because someone is also a survivor does not mean in that he or she is trustworthy. You never really know a person until they are given the opportunity to betray you or to hurt you. Plus, we often become the people we choose to surround ourselves with. If you surround yourself with good, uh, um, with good nature people, you will of course pick up their good manners too. But if you surround yourself with outlaws, then obviously you have to break a few rules to survive among such groups. And no matter what group you are with, here is a tip that will make you an indispensable player in any group. Be resourceful and always be speedy. Frankly, there will always be way more attacks than and people in the time of any zombie apocalypse. And you sure need to be able to pull more than your weight to, and this will give your group a strong reason to protect you and to keep them as like, and to keep you as a part of the group. Do you remember Jerry from World War II? Uh, he was the only person that has the potential to find a cure to zombies. And of course, so many people risked their life and lost their life just to protect him and his family just for the potential of a cure. Finally, never stop believing and never stop fighting. Never, never stop fighting. And an apocalypse, just like any difficult situation, is not a time for you to doubt yourself. Instead of doubting yourself, you have to tell yourself, yes, I can. You have never done it before? It's okay, yes, I can. I will figure it out. Things may seem really bad and scary when there are zombies everywhere, but remember, zombies are just zombies. They are predictable and they don't have a brain. You will for sure be able to outwit them. All you have to do is to observe your enemy's pattern and find a way to outwit them. Every single movie I have seen, all the survivors and all the protagonists, they find their way and they survive. And you can do it too. And it may also help if you set a goal to keep yourself on track. Do you remember the movie Zombieland? The whole entire movie, the group only had two goals. First is to find an, is to find an amusement park. Second is to have Twinkies. They <laughs> keep that goal in mind throughout the movie. And of course, by the end, not only did they survive, they were rewarded with a truckload of Twinkies <laughs> and a zombie-free amusement park. <laughs> There are many rules and lessons that I often like to pick up from different movies. And I, but especially with zombie movies, I highly recommend all parents to encourage their kids to watch zombie movies. 
<laughs> because uh, other kids can pick up a lot of valuable lessons from it. But let me remind you, what are the three things that I find are the most important? First, realize that you are never alone. You are never, never alone. Second, align yourself with good people. Be resourceful and stay current. Lastly, never stop believing in your dreams. Think. Keep working toward your goals and you will get there. Even if you feel trapped and feel like you are surrounded by um, incapable airhead everywhere, don't be afraid. Please do remember that zombies are just zombies. They are big dummies. They have no brains, but you all have yours, and you will for sure be able